Hi, I'm going to talk about health for a minute. Now, this is by a registered dietitian, evidence-based nutrition recommendation, and they break everything down and it's very credible. I can tell you some uh, pitfalls of a plant-based or meat-based diet, but also tells you the sources of everything and how to couple them for the greatest potential. Now, someone the other day told me, um, we develop larger brains at one point in history due to our meat-based diets. Now, I don't doubt that we needed meat back in the day before we had all this information at our fingertips and all these foods available in stores. But I asked them, what in meat can't we get from other areas that are good for our brain? I mean, it was a legit concern, but with some research, you'd find the only reason some dietitians or doctors say eat fish is for the omega-3s. But you can get it through other things. Now, this is very science-based. gives you the, the hard facts. Breaks everything down. Now, I do want to say a dietitian is much more credible than a doctor. Um, so it lists the, the sources as well, like you can get omega-3s for your brain and heart health via chia seed, flax seed, hemp seed, walnuts, calcium, broccoli is a good source, so bro broccoli is a good source. So you can go to veganhealth.org by dietitians, registered dietitian. Slightly lower rates of osteoporosis in vegans. And this is plant-based sources of calcium. B12, like nutritional yeast, which is a good um, replacement. So you can see you can break, it breaks everything down. Um, let's look at iron. Tell you the sources. Very specific, very credible. One spinach is a good source of iron, as you see here. I will cook it slightly. It actually reduces more or increases the iron output. And also, if you couple it with other foods, sometimes that can have a benefit as well. So, as you can see, breaks it all down, veganhealth.org. Uh, we live longer on average based on large studies of Seventh-day Adventists and Buddhists. The American Heart Association endorses it at any life stage, as well as the Dietetic Association. Any life stage. You also have plant-based dietitian. Credentials. This has a lot of sources though. Veganhealth.org, PCRM.org. It's more about doctors and such. Not as credible with doctors, but Physicians Committee for Responsible Medicine rather than pills. And then CancerProject.org, like colon cancer. So, well, you may have some legit concerns been proving large studies of Buddhist Seventh-day Adventists who have been veg forever. I've been for over 25 years, work out a lot, body built. Veganbodybuilding.com is another source. So we live longer on average, less rates of heart disease, colon cancer, and many other leading killers. So like to debunk 
the myths. We have no need for animal products this day and age. Thank you, and look up a factory farm video.